The Shanghai Cooperation Organization Summit wrapped up with the Astana SCO declaration in Kazakhstan on Thursday, adopting Belarus as the 10th member of the organization after Iran joined last year. At least 20 major documents have been signed at the summit in Astana, including the SCO development strategy until 2035, the energy cooperation development strategy until 2030, and the program of cooperation in countering terrorism, separatism, and extremism for 2025 to 2027. Beijing says the leaders of participating member states have pledged to strengthen cooperation in the fields of trade, transportation, energy, finance, agriculture, the digital economy, scientific and technological innovation, as well as deepen people-to-people and cultural exchanges. The leaders of member states said they are aware that the international landscape is undergoing major changes and agreed that the United Nations should play a central coordinating role in promoting the building of a more just global system. The leaders also agreed to strengthen efforts to tackle security threats and challenges, crack down on the three armed forces, namely terrorism, separatism, and extremism, drug trafficking and organized transactional crime, and support the international community's efforts to promote peace and development in Afghanistan. They also voiced support for the comprehensive and just settlement of the Palestinian issue based on a two-state solution. China is a founding member of the SCO and will take the rotating presidency. Beijing says it hopes to open up a new chapter of cooperation while contributing to security, stability, development, as well as prosperity of all countries on a path of building a community with a shared future.